Well, I'm back with another five minute video. I had a hydrocelectomy two days ago, two mornings ago, and uh, prep was easy. Basically, don't eat before you know, your surgery or drink anything. You don't have to shave anything or anything like that. Mine was, I think, relatively small. It's about the size of a grape compared to some people. So just to tell you what happened, uh, went into surgery and they uh, cut, you know, put me out. And as soon as I woke up, I did feel a pain. And every guy, I think, knows what it feels like, you know, when you injure that area. And that's pretty much what it feels like. It's that way, but it doesn't get better <laughs> uh, for the first half of the day. Uh, so they will give you, you know, pain pills, which do help, obviously. Um, ice, um, I've been using bags of peas, two of them to alternate. The ice actually works better than the pain meds, in my opinion, and that helped me through the first day. And the second day, today's, I guess, the third day, and uh, <clears throat> I didn't use any uh, oxycodone or any pain pills. I used a little ibuprofen. Um, actually, I was thinking on switching off ibuprofen with the pain pills, but I, I don't even need the pain pills, so if, I'm the kind of person who won't take pain pills if I don't have to. And, uh, but with that, um, you do have to wear a jack strap for about a week and uh, I have not been really following my doctor's orders but follow your doctor's orders but I have not in, in terms of when I sleep um, I don't wear it because I find it actually more comfortable not to wear it but if you turn over or do something wrong whew, you'll wake up and know it so you don't want you don't want to mess with that you know too much you know that do that at your own discretion some people need a tube I understand a drainage tube they did not give me one either so I think I'm on my way um, to to healing but I just wanted to tell you my experience with it it's not a big deal I've had um, bilateral inguinal repair and that was a, the pain on that was worse so this is not that bad but don't go in there thinking it's just gonna be in and out and you'll be back to work you know in a few days um, I, I'm still told not to lift anything for four weeks and so I'll, I'll do that and just binge watch you know my shows on TV so comment below if you have any questions and, or if you've had this done and let us know your experience.